Stevenson claims the Buffalo Wild Wings Classic Championship, 75-72 over FDU Florham. Glenn Clark with Coach Gary Stewart. Coach, perhaps fitting, they're called the Devils. They would not uh, let you go at any point tonight. They just kept hanging around and hanging around. How proud are you of your team for the fact that every time they had an answer, your team came up with one themselves? Well, we knew it was going to be a tug of war. You know, it's um, – uh, uh, as I mentioned to you last night, they were a difficult guard. Uh, they had 33 uh, three-point field goal attempts tonight, and uh, they kind of leave you on an island. So it's almost like one-on-one because you can't help from the perimeter. And if you don't get them under control on the dribble and they put the ball in the paint, uh, now all of a sudden you're collapsing and then they're kicking out for threes. Um, and our guys kind of just hung in, hung in, hung in. Um, and finally we were able to put uh, a couple stops together in the second half and, and get some separation. The big thing, obviously, Mark Terrell finishes with 35 points. We've talked about Mark in the first two games. But I think one of the things I noticed tonight is even the attention that he gets and what that can do for everybody else because he's got good vision to get the ball back outside. So even though he scored 35, I thought some of the other big plays were the ones where he got it inside the double team and was able to kick it back out. Yeah, one of the best things about his game is his ability to pass. I mean, he's a highly skilled guy, and – um, if he was a different size with the same skill set, he would he would be fine as as a guard. Uh, he can face the basket, obviously. He can make shots. He handles the ball. Um, he's a, he's a really good player. You uh, to win a, the tournament to put together two games like this this weekend after the tough start of the season. How important is this for this team? I think it's critical. You know, we we went into this weekend without Evan and. And uh, we're, we're playing without Marcus and, and, uh, and didn't have Mikey. So those are three really, really important uh, pieces. So it, it gives us confidence. Um, we've talked about the strength in numbers. We can go deep into our bench. And we've got some really, really good players down there. And, and that showed this weekend. I saw you went to Bo Wesley in the first half tonight. I know that he didn't get a lot of minutes, but maybe a sign of you have even more options as the season goes along. We like Bo. You know, he's a guy that can uh, defend on the interior. He's uh, an innate shot blocker. Um, uh, really good defenders his defense is ahead of his offense and, and we we like that because um, we're, we're trying to get a defensive mindset your message to your team you get the uh, the week off before you get back to action next Saturday I'm assuming it's uh, you know uh, ease up on the carbs on Thursday something like that make sure that you're still ready to go to play basketball we haven't got to Thursday yet yeah we're gonna get after it uh, Monday in the weight room and, and then uh, practice and film and and uh, we've got a lot to get better at and um, we've got a good, good, good part of the year for us uh, this whole week where we don't have a game. Um, it's, it's a good time for us to uh, improve on some of the things that obviously we saw this weekend that we, we need to address. Right. Coach, happy Thanksgiving and congratulations on the win. We'll see you next Saturday. Same to you and happy Thanksgiving to everybody out there. Coach Gary Stewart, I'm Glenn Clark for GoMustangSports.com.